I still can't read these. Why should we hide where we are? Secrets are Odin's way. Shouldn't we be open? Like Tyr? Tyr kept secrets too, for good reasons. To protect people. It is wiser to be discreet. That doesn't mean you should lie to your friends. Or your family. I'm sure Sindri would understand and do the same, lad. Go. So, lad, excited to finally see the land of the giants? Yeah. But also sad the journey's almost over. Oh, what if we get to Jotunheim and there aren't any giants there either? Makes little difference to us. Fulfilling your mother's wish is what is important. Ah! Oh, don't go anywhere. Be with you in two shakes. Father, can I tell him? No. Tell me what? Did you put this wheel in your mouth? Oh, God. I I'll vomit. I I'm not kidding. I'll throw up on it. It is nothing. A family matter. Oh. Uh, uh, oh, I can tell you a thing or two about family matters. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh. Let me guess. Your brother isn't as talented as you, and his work is junk. Um, those things are accurate. Your point? It's all you ever talk about, over and over. Do something about it or shut up already. I see. Yeah! We're sick of hearing about little people's little problems! Um... Alright. That hurt a little. Let's have a look at your gear then. I'm glad I'm still useful to you. Don't need me anymore, huh? God of War, so I haven't narrated really too much in these last couple of videos, and that's gonna continue for this one. I'm only picking here because it's a lot of combat, and I think it's a spot I can find really, really so it's an ogre we gotta deal with, stuff we've done before, you know, not really too big of a deal. But uh, this video and the next one are going to be a whole lot of sort of cinematic events where we have to climb the whole mountain again because we have to live through Atreus being a stupid little crack now because he's found out God, but hey, I guess I would probably act that way too at his age if I found out that my dad was Although I don't really think Kratos is a girl that he dies so much when you play this game on God mode. Anyway, uh, that's going to be really the main thing with this is just kind of redoing the mountain. There's not really as many puzzles as we have to do the first time around, and since we've already done this, it shouldn't be too difficult to get through again. Uh, we will have to do a couple of puzzles in that big great room that had that elevator the first time, but besides that, I don't really think there's anything much to talk about until we get past uh, the mountain park and do some really dang cool bosses that are going to be coming up here soon. So that'll be it for me for now, and I'll see you in uh, two or three videos, or I'll see you however many videos it takes for the cutscene to end up. I'll see this wolf hood. Really but wolves aren't really too bad, they just dodge you a lot, a lot of unbreakable attacks. Don't be afraid to throw your axe at them, even though they like to dodge that a lot, and use your runic abilities if you can. <laughs> this one was just being a pest though, I don't really know why. There we go, being so annoying. Finally got him out, still managed to hit me. I think I get close to dying, but I get him anyway. Anyway, that's gonna be it for me. Uh, for gonna be alright! thought that was gonna stop us. <sighs> okay, which way up?
broken again. You know, I'm starting to question Cinder's skill. Maybe Brock was right all along. Why did you speak to the dwarf like that? Aren't you sick of hearing about him and his brother? Of course. But it serves nothing to make an enemy of him. He should know the truth, even if it hurts. It was needless and unkind. The truth is more important than kindness. Your mother would disagree. She wasn't a god. there. You know I can handle it. Can you? After the way you spoke of her, I question that. What? That she wasn't a god? She was better than a god. And you shall not dishonor her. Fine. Carry her yourself. Yodenheim before we get there or whatever. Isn't it a lot simpler if they want us dead because we're gods? Do they think we're a threat? I suppose we can't rule it out. But Odin's ways are subtle. His purposes uh, are... Enough about Odin and his whole stupid family.
whatever. Whoa! I suppose that's Odin's doing too. Nice try. Mother always said all gods were evil, but we're not. You wasn't. Freya neither. The Acer gods, that's who's evil. And you know what? Odin's right. We are a threat, because we know what they are and we know we can beat them. Well, not all of them. Not yet. Magni did his worst, and he's dead. They're no better than us, and they're gonna be sorry they picked this fight. Like he did more than that. Move it. Or we'll pick up where he left off. I'll kill you. No. He is beaten. Not worth killing. He should pay for what he said about mother. I said no. But we're gods. We can do whatever we want. <laughs> That's what I said to your mother right before I gave it to her. What are you doing? This is a much better knife than mother's. <laughs> Control. Haven't you been teaching me to kill? I have been teaching you to survive. We are gods, boy. And that makes us a target. From now until the end of days, you are marked. So I teach you to kill, yes. But in defense of yourself. Never as an indulgence. Nobody cared about him anyways. What's the difference? There are consequences to killing a god! Why? How do you know? How do you know? Watch your tone, boy. Whatever. 